The reason I decided to enroll in this course and the challenges I was having that led me to that decision was currently as I work, um, we are in the process of making some major decision in terms of strategic changes. So how we offer courses to our students and making that those decisions in, require you to think outside the box. And in thinking outside the box, I realized that there were some little things that we needed to, to think about in terms of what are the implicit biases that we each come into the decision process with and how do we work beyond those biases so that we're making the best decisions for our students or as best as we know how to. And that's part of the challenge we had and then come into this course as um, helped me with determining how I will go back to the office and contribute to us as an executive team making decisions. What I learned that surprised me the most is how quickly the human brain processes information and what it takes for us to make instantaneous decisions and the retention of information when we're in those long two hour meetings and how our, our thought process and attention span changes over time if the information being shared is not interactive. The way in which I will apply what I've learned for this course in my professional role is to actually go back and highlight those key areas of when making a decision, what are the key things for us to think about, to think about cross-collaboration, to think about our own internal biases that play into how we make decisions, and how do we put possible benchmarks in place that help us as we're making those decisions as to this is where we're starting, this is where we're going, and how we're going to get there, and still asking that so what question as to how we will move forward.